Hey YouTube, how's it going? How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing fantastic. If this is your first time checking out Julia Divine's channel, what is up? My name is Amy. If you're returning, guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so this is your whoever needs a message for Thursday, March 19th. So hope you hope you yeah, hopefully you guys are doing well if I could speak. Still trying to wake up and have my coffee, but I wanted to get this out. So great messages. We're gonna get messages from the, the angel deck today. Just felt like it was relevant and felt like it needed to be heard so three cards came through so we have reward yourself you've been giving a lot of yourself lately and it's time for you to receive make the time to reward yourself in a meaningful way this balance of giving and receiving is essential to keeping your energy mood and motivation at a consistently high level i love this and i love that this is coming up i love this because i feel like during such a really troubled time as much as I'm saying that we need to be there for other people, that we need to be there for our neighbors and our family, and you need to be there for yourself too. And I'm not in a like, you know, a selfish kind of way, but just being able to have a bubble bath or to binge watch your favorite show with your favorite glass of wine. Or I know that, you know, a lot of us are on lockdown right now, so we can't really go too far out of the house. We can't go to the spas and we can't get our nails done, but it's, you know, you can do your own damn nails. You can do your own damn toenails, right? Like, it's about doing something today that's going to uplift you. It's about doing something today that's going to make you feel beautiful. It's going to make you feel good. Um, with all of the negative stuff going on in the world, you can do something from your home to uplift you. You know, whether that's taking a walk out into the trails, whether that's, you know, just having a nice bubble bath with some meditation music, whatever it is, guys, do something today that is going to uplift you, that is going to bring some positivity into your life. Um, especially if you have been giving out, giving to other people, it's about pulling that back and giving to you because if you aren't strong, if you aren't taking care of your emotional, your physical, your mental and your spiritual needs, you're going to drain yourself out. And, and that's what I feel is the message today is that, you know, know that as much as you want to help other people, if you are not a hundred percent right with who you are and and, and yourself, then you can't offer that to other people because you just burn yourself out. So it's about getting right with who you are today, understanding that you have to um, work on you to be able to help other people. Okay. So we have trustworthy and guidance. You received a wonderful idea as an answer to your prayers. This idea is real and trustworthy. You can safely move forward with it knowing that we are with you every step of the way. Ask for and be open to receiving or support for anything you need related to this idea. So if you've been planning to, I don't know, start a home line, home line, home line, <laughs> start an online business or something to do from staying at home, that that's kind of what I'm getting from this card today is know that that's like validation coming through that. Yes, like this is the perfect time to start working from home. Or this is the perfect time to start, you know, doing a passion or something, something that you've been putting off for, you know, years, months, whatever it is. Like now is the perfect time while we're in lockdown, while we're in isolation mode to be able to do whatever it is that you've been called to do. Um, whether that's starting your YouTube channel, whether that's promoting, you know, a product, whatever it is. It's knowing that you have the guidance behind you from the angels. You have the guidance. You have the yes. You have the trust. Like go ahead and do it started feeling right so I also feel like this is like trusting in who you are um because if you don't trust in in your product if you don't trust in your business if you don't trust in who you are and what you're capable of doing then how do you expect someone else to trust you and that's it at the end of the day. you got to trust that what you're putting out it is what you believe in inside okay so the last card coming up says time to go. The sun sets and rises each day and it's the same with the avenues in your life. See the beauty within each sunset in your life and know that the sun will always rise again tomorrow. Endings are merely the start of new beginnings and we are with you through each phase and cycle. So yeah, you know, some of you are ending some things and starting new things and change is scary, right? Like I've been saying that for, for a long time, that change is scary. And we all know this. And, and when you get custom to doing stuff one way or, or doing stuff that way. And then all of a sudden things are changed or you've been in a relationship for a while and, and are married and you know, you, you get divorced or, you know, you guys break up and now you're forced to be single. 
you know, when you go through those stages, it's freaking scary because you're kind of like, I'm so used to having someone and now I don't have anyone. So the first couple of months, you're like, oh my God, like, how am I going to do this? And then after you get over that hump, it's like, oh my God, why did I wait so long to be single? Or why did I wait so long to leave that relationship? Right. Cause now I'm living my best life. So that's kind of what I'm saying. What I'm seeing here is that with these three cards right here, you could be in this place right now, and I don't want to say this, but you could be in this place right now where you've been thinking about leaving a relationship or marriage, and, you know, spirits just coming through and saying, like, you're in this place where if that's how you feel and your happiness and fulfillment is not coming, like, it's not coming from that relationship, then this might be the perfect opportunity for you to really go within these next couple of weeks and, and really think about what it is that you guys want. Because that's kind of what I'm picking up for somebody. It's not going to resonate for everyone. But I do feel like some of you might be in this place where the relationships or the marriages that you're in right now, they're not of your highest good. Like, you are you feel stuck. So, you know, know that whatever you're feeling today, tomorrow is always going to be, in, like, tomorrow is always going to be a new day. But a lot of you are ending things, and with that ending comes a new beginning. But it's also coming in with a lot of fear. It's coming with like coming in with a lot of change. So I don't want you guys to fear that. And I don't want you guys to be afraid of change because after changes comes amazing things and amazing opportunities. Okay. So I'm going to leave it there because this is the only. This is the whoever needs a message. So with that, you guys, you take care, and I'll see you guys again tomorrow.